not watching the best of you. Yo, yo, what's good, YouTube? It's your boy, Bob Best, and I'm back with another reaction video today. To everybody reacting to Kodak Black closure, you feel me? Um, Kodak Black is in his bag right now, you feel me, right now? Right now, like, I don't know, like, I don't know if it's because the whole Jack Boy situation is going on, but he's in his bag right now. I feel like when Kodak Black is going through some shit, which is sad to say, you feel me? When he's going through some shit, personally, he makes the best music, you feel me? I don't like to see him go through shit, but I ain't gonna hold you. That's when he makes the best music. Even Jack Boy, even that I don't force my hand... Uh, uh, that shit was fire. Both far, both sides be getting great news, but it's sad they going through this situation. Hopefully they can squash that beef. But I know um, Kodak Black responded to um, "Don't Force My Hand" and doing a little back and forth. I heard just one of the songs responding back to. So this will be my first time checking it out. Let me go see how this shit fire. Uh, this the Kodak. I've, I like what I'm hearing from Kodak right now. When you chillin', that's when they play with you the most. Nah, that's a fact. They be playing with people because they think people be on sweet time. But they don't know you really ten times worse. Keep them niggas out they feelings when they chose. You can have your nigga in prison feeling hurt. When you chillin', that's when they play with you the most. But they don't know you really ten times worse. That's when you know a nigga in his bag, bro. When a nigga sitting down and he writing songs and shit, he's smoking. That's when you know, like, if he was really writing a song that you know he was in his bag because he, he re going through some shit. Yo, niggas, how they feelings when they jokes? You can have your nigga in prison feeling hurt. Put the pen and paper for you in time like a verse. Out of everybody you call, you know I'm pulling up first. In the next side of town, just a triple up the work. I always stood my ground and put it down on the turf. No nights on the block, selling rocks, I rehearse. Got to cut the chart to talk just so I can have a verse. Every year around this time, we'll be all on the curve. Cold as fuck outside, no John on our shirt. Break bread with the family, you felt you had to be first. Everybody happy, you want to be happier. We you know what's coming next. He said, everybody happier, you want to be a happier, you feel me? Like, sometimes, you feel me? Like, like if we all win it as a team, bro, we all supposed to be happy. But niggas be want to be the top dog, and that's only when they're going to be happy. And it's sad that niggas get to that point. When we your team, we supposed to be all happy together, you feel me? It's, that's a weed, but everybody be want to do it for me. It's been shit block in a hearse. Been put in front of the eggs like that fire I eat murders. This ain't bitches to flip, but that's my nigga, can't forget him. Nobody check for cool, but I still tell them that we miss him. I'm still chasing the dream that we had when we were children. Let niggas serve and feed, got the studio in the kitchen. I was just there in the mansion, when mama started bitching. Cause everybody told I was here in the penitentiary. I'm outside with guns. Well, you heard him, he said something about. He was just in a match where everybody told his mind he's gonna jump. I know them niggas hurt, bro. I love I love the stories when a, like the underdog wins. Like, you feel me when they, everybody the nigga that everybody doubted or uh, overcomes the top. I feel like I'm one of them niggas that everybody doubted, and now I'm about to show everybody I'm about to be one of the top dogs. You feel me? Wait, so is this where you talk about court? Is this where you talk about Jack right here? I heard something you moved to the hood. Oh, now he talk about Jack, bro. Yo, how y'all feel about that whole situation, bro? I feel like both of them got like. They both got wrong things that they both did wrong. You feel me? And they both got things that they right. You feel me? I feel like, I feel like Kodak is mad. This is what I get from it. This is what I'm gonna understand. I feel like Kodak is upset that Jack Boy didn't give him no money when he came home after promising him, oh, I'm gonna do this for Kodak when he get home. I'm gonna get Kodak a million dollars and he ain't live up to that junk. But then again, I feel like Kodak, this shit right here, man, you feel me? That nigga was shouting y'all saying free you, all type shit. Y'all was on the phone, so it was like y'all was in communication and shit like that with each other. And then, like, you come home, like, that's your man. You shouldn't respect, you should be happy that he's on top. You feel me? You should be happy he's winning. Like, I feel like if my man came home, even if he promised me a certain amount of money, as long as I know I'm set and he's set, we winning. You feel me? So, 
both of them, I see where they both right and wrong. You feel me? If that's what if that's what the issue is, because even when Kodak first came home, Jack Boy was saying I'm happy uh, Kodak is home, so I feel like that's the reason they beef with each other. Unless some shit happened that I'm, I I missed. When you chillin', when they play with you the most, but they don't know you really ten times worse. worse. Keep your niggas out they feelings when they choke, and you can't have your niggas in prison feeling hurt. When you chillin', that's when they play with you the most, but they don't know you really ten times worse. Keep your niggas out they feelings when they choke, you can't have your nigga in prison feeling hurt. I love you, but my heart telling me to hate you. You wanted me. They ain't said, I love you, but my, my heart telling you I hate you. I swear to God, he still got love for Jack Boy, bro. Somebody need to put them on the phone and get them to be interact with each other, you feel me? Like, I think that's what all it takes is a phone call. She's saying, you know how men be. Men just be too prided and they don't want to ever reach out to each other. But it's like they still got love for each other, bro. Whoever could get them on the phone, get them on the phone, please. Let them squash this shit. I'm tired of seeing them beefing, even though they making great music. I'd rather see them be cool and make terrible music. I want to say terrible music, but like, not pain, not so much pain music, you feel me? But I rest it'll be cool. Keep your niggas out they feelings when they choke. And you can't have your nigga in prison feeling hurt. When you chillin' us when they play with you the most. But they don't know you really ten times verse. Keep your niggas out they feelings when they choke. You can't have your nigga in prison feeling hurt. I love you, but my heart telling me to hate you. You wanted me to be in jail trying to chase you. It ain't about what you do, it's how you. Oh, he said you wanted me to be in jail. I think that's the part where um I remember I seen a Jack Boy live where he was like where he said something like, um I missed the old Kodak, send this Kodak to jail, you feel me? And you know as a street nigga you're not supposed to wish jail on a another nigga, whether it's your enemy, your friend, or whatever it like like what if he killed your mom. As a street nigga you gotta live by the street code. So I feel like I heard Kodak too, like he felt like damn you want me in jail or some shit. You can have your nigga in prison feeling hurt. I love you but my heart telling me He said, I get a sense for you since my, since my, um, let me see what he said again. The numbers on it like you want me with it. And then we talk about this thing about the business. I ain't get a sentence for you since my sentence. Yeah, so was Jack Boy not putting money on Kodak Black Books during this whole time? And I, everybody here thinking it really, bro. Somebody put these niggas on the phone, bro. Like, put these niggas on the phone, please. Cause it's a dumb situation. There's two things I always tell my people that I never want to follow about: females and money, bro. And right now, I feel like they're falling out behind money, and they got millions of dollars to their name, bro. Like, it's not no issue to beef about. And I understand our principles and shit, but I ain't gonna lie. I think Jack Boy love Kodak. I think Kodak love Jack Boy. Like, I see, it just they let money interfere with. They getting too big. They getting too big headed, and they got too many yes men around them. But on the streets, everybody's thinking you're the realest Cause you're screaming for me and SG on your pen Even though he said, I'm on the streets, everybody think you're the realest Cause you're screaming for us But wasn't he talking to him on the phone? Why wouldn't Jack Boy put money on Kodak books? I don't understand You could've sent your dog a pen Got bro don't send him pictures of you like nigga Why you ain't sent it? Of course that shit impressive But right now it don't impress me Yeah, that shit look cool But it's some shit we ain't addressing You know you owe me money I don't want no pictures of you flexing When you're my time to write so that's what the issue is about, bro. How, how much did he owe him, bro? How much y'all think he owe him, bro? He said, I don't want no pictures of you flexing. He said, please jump on him. Bro, I could swear, y'all remember the pressure video? He said, never forget loyalty. You holding it down. Like, wasn't Jack Boy and Clark talking on the phone all the time? Or are we missing something? Or well, that's my else recording? Cause it seemed like Jack Boy and Kodak was on the phone all the time. And, he, and you know Jack Boy was repping Sniper Gang like a motherfucker back then. Like he was repping Sniper Gang like that was like that was his shit. Like he go the whole sick, the same way as Kodak. <laughs> so it's not about no money. It's about the principle. It's about the loyalty. Man, please, someone put him on the phone. Yeah, Kodak said he threw a hundred in the ocean. What ocean, bro? What, who could swim? Can't people, can humans swim in the ocean or some shit like that? We don't get that hundred back, bro. I need that. I ain't gonna hold you. I'm tired of working nine to five.
Nah, you could tell they both genuinely hurt. That's crazy, cause you got to know my every time Jack, Jack was in jail, Kodak Black was out there, or vice versa. It always used to be, it was rare that they both was out at the same time. And now that it is the fact they both out at the same time, they beefing is weird as hell. As bosses, bro, as bosses, bro, y'all can have different opinions and still be mans, bro. I don't agree with everything my man says or he, he does, but that's my man. That's why that's what it's cool. That's why it's okay not to have yes men around you, bro. You got both bosses and leaders, bro. But can someone please put them on the floor? I don't know. Who, I don't know if it could be G1. I don't know if it could be John Wick. I don't know if it could be 100K. Cause I know he managed them. I won't put. I don't care. Someone put them on the phone and squash this beef. Cause it's dumb, bro. It's dumb. For me, I feel they still got love for each other. It's just like these two big headed, like even the Jack, um, Jack Wick sign said, Play big brother. This is me putting away my pride. You feel me? He called him big brother. You still, so he still got that respect for him. Whoa, <laughs> nah, that's what he's saying for the Whoa, they, so they gotta fight it out, bro. <laughs> Nah, this song got eight. Nah, this is a ten out of ten. I was about to say eight. This is a ten out of ten. This that pain. You can tell Kodak Black is still in them trenches. I feel that vibe for me, Kodak. I don't know who you could call. I know you still got love for Jack Boy, but I, I, you gotta start making them threats. Leave that shit the music for me. I don't want y'all to say something y'all can never come back from. Both of y'all, like on both ends, you feel me? I don't really like the fact y'all talk about y'all could kill each other. Or it's weird that you go, you could kill your friend. Cut that shit out. If y'all feeling some type of way about each other, keep it that way. But don't be talking about, don't be threatening nobody in life, especially y'all supposed to be brothers, you feel me? Y'all come from the same area, whatever the case be. Y'all came up together, you feel me? Kodak Black, you, of course, the bigger artist, you feel me? But Jack Boy wouldn't be nothing without uh, Kodak. I'm pretty sure you wouldn't be nothing without Jack Boy at one point in time, because I was your right hand man. But yeah, I get this a 10 out of 10. I hope these niggas squash beef. I'm tired of hearing these niggas beefing, bro. Even though they making great, great music, they making like that pain. Like I didn't play "Don't Force My Hand" and I didn't play um "Super." What's that? "Super Jerk." I forgot what the junk called. But I didn't play that millions of times, like in the last two weeks. You feel me? But yeah, y'all like, comment, subscribe. Y'all follow me on all social media. Um, more interview dropping soon. I got interviews in Orlando I just did coming soon. I'm going to be in Temple soon. So if you're in Temple, make sure you reach out to me for an interview. I might take over Florida. Nah, I ain't going to take over Florida, but I'm going to come and do my thing in Florida. But we out. Check it. Check it. Trials and tribulations. I'm just trying to live my life, hoping I make the right decisions. Cause I wanna live it right. I remember nights, no sleep, feeling weaker than seven days. Now I'm using my clever ways to make sure my song's getting played. But these niggas doubt me, they think I'm not gonna make it. But soon I'm gonna be rich and happy, and girl getting naked. I promise you, I'm the best of Prime Nike. I'm on the ride, smoking dope, and I'm getting high. Spirit, she floating to the sky. I wonder, is they gon' think I'm a joke because.